okay? So there's your Black Panther setup. But notice how this is. This is important because now look, what am I in? Elbow stay. How do we get there? So if you're familiar with the regular armbar version, I get the hand, I go to choke him, I get rid of that, I come to here, I get my set up, I push his head away, and then I come over and go into the armbar. If here he grabs my foot, I can't get that. I want to keep the arm, and I've got a snake. So my foot was here, I've got a snake all the way down here. Now I can get the bite, see? I can get my thigh nice and deep on his throat, because my weight is laying down on the thigh. Then I can lock this over. If I want the armbar, there's the armbar. If I want the triangle, I keep the arm and bring my knees together. And that way I can get that choke. Or I have the armbar here. In order to get this bite, I, my, my leg can't still be down by the shoulder. I have to snake onto it so that I can get it nice and deep. If his arm bends, there's an Americana right there. You have tons of submissions in this position. But the core thing you gotta think about is setting him up so that he can't move. But the key to getting from here to here is snaking over to the right, from here, snaking over to the right, and then sitting this in real deep. So his head's real deep and your thigh is resting on the ground. So you have a nice secure lock here and you're an elbow snake. If I want the triangle, you keep that. You keep this so that it's even tighter, like I have a giant thick thigh, and squeeze the knees together. Okay? But the key is really basics. The elbow stick, you guys all learned from Joe years ago. I'm just like this, except I'm like this. Okay? Does that help? Okay.